probably the worst part of the run. They're having fun. Yeah, the boat only weighs 200 pounds. Wow. That's a that so, would be. Stainless steel transom. Obviously, it's a PVC hull. Then yeah. we weld our seams. We don't glue them. Yeah. That's got to be. How fast they? With a 50 horsepower motor, we're running about a 15, 16 pitch uh, semi cleaver surface prop. You're going to see 52, 55, depending on the weight of the boat, who's in the boat. And it'll do three G's in a turn. And you can launch it 15 feet here off the wave if you want to. Yeah. <laughs> but that's, that's what the boat was designed for. How the easily do they flip over? They don't flip over easily. I'm okay. not saying that it's not going to flip go over on yeah. you. Yeah. Uh, if you see the, the back of the boat, it's like a torpedo shape. It's yeah. like a bullet. Basically, that'll dig in the water and tend to send Got the front it. of the nose of the boat down. Right. Beautiful. That looks, see, that would be fun. Oh. Like, Look at that. Oh, man, that looks wild. On this one, I just have the 25. Like, you don't have to put a 50 on it, you know what I mean? And you can ski behind it, tube, and all that really? kind of stuff. And it fits underneath the horsepower restrictions that are put on kids now from 16 to 12. And 200 pounds, you can throw it behind a motorcycle. Yep, exactly. Seriously, oh wow. Yeah. Here, I'll give you one of these. Yeah, give me a car. Yeah, I should. If you guys want to go for a ride, I'd be more than happy to take you out. I'll be doing demos all over Ontario this summer. Excellent. Yeah, I'm the North American to. distributor for them. So. Oh, I went on uh, a huge one down in uh, uh, the East Coast. Okay. And we're out whale watching. Yeah. So it was one of those big, huge things. It was okay. Wrong. Yeah, the big we, rips. We yeah. Had, oh, God. We had major waves. Yeah. Like this. And yeah. The thing just took it, right? Well, these types of boats in the ribs, too, they're more popular overseas than they are here, but that's what they're all designed for ocean. Right? It's for fun, yeah. yeah. Oh, that just looks... Where's that film? Where's South that? Africa. That's where these originated. Yeah. All we do is build race boats. You can use it for recreational use, oh, yeah. too. But this is a race boat. Yeah. This just looks like a ton of fun. And it's a true full tunnel hall, asymmetrical tunnel. If you look right. at the back here... Yeah, I, I just have a height Oh, did you? Okay. Yeah. Well, then you understand. And I ran a Koenig German racing motor. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. These are, we call these hijacks. It sounds like hockey puck. Oh. The and, the rubber. and that gives us the rigidity out of the boat. We're putting okay. about 11 PSI in these hijackers and six in the top ones. But yeah, it is a true tunnel. Okay. Speed tubes or whatever yeah. you call them on them. Yeah. Do they come bigger at all? Like No, just we just size? make the one 13 foot size. The other companies do, like uh, he was mentioning ducks, they make different sizes. but. Yeah. We've designed our boat this is the best size for the horsepower, and yeah. we don't diversify from that. Do you have options with motors at all? Like 50 and down. 50 or different like manufacturers. Yeah. Uh, I carry, the, I'm an OEM for Tohatsu. They're the only ones you get short shafts from basically now. Uh, yeah. 30. The boats were originally ocean rescue boats from South Africa. Um, it is a true tunnel hall design. We only build race boats. The boat itself weighs 200 pounds. Maximum horsepower on it is 50 horsepower, which you can run any lower than that. Um, stainless steel transom, it's a wash through design, so the boat cannot get swamped. Uh, PVC tunnel, we thermally weld our seams. Most other co competition glue there's. Um, there's four compartments, two in each tunnel, and also there's the sky jackers on, hijackers on the bottom. That, that's where we get our rigidity from. Um, what else? It's two people for racing. A single person can drive it also. Um, the co pilot actually acts as a ballast when they race them. He moves forward and back to increase and decrease speed because we don't use trim on the motors when they're racing. Top speed you'll find with a 50 horsepower motor is around 50 to 55 miles an hour. Uh, three G's in a turn, and obviously, from watching the video, you can blast through 10, 15 foot waves. Right yeah, with uh, the, the Toronto Outboard Club, we're going to be doing three demo races this year. Um, we haven't set the dates for firm, but we are doing demo races. That's our goal, is to get a racing class going across Canada. There is racing in the States. Um, I don't have the information on where they're racing, but there is a race. It's, it's really large over in South Africa, Australia, New Zealand.